Hello YouTube. Well, I thought I'd do a quick video of uh, my car and how it's all going. It's not doing too bad. A bit jerky, I think the clutch is on its way out. It's done 65,000 miles I suppose. So it's getting a bit uh, a bit old and old and tated. Uh, other than that, it's working pretty good. As you can see, all nice and well. <clears throat> First time I've done a video where I've been driving along with my camera. Uh, yes, yeah, it's, it's all nice. Everything seems to be working pretty good. The car's nice, nice and warm. Heaters are blowing lovely and warm as well, which is a good sign. Never really get any problems with this car and the heaters. The heaters are always really good. I changed the thermostat on it not long ago, but uh, yeah. I had to, you know, make sure it was all nice and um, all nice and uh, and good. Turns out the thermostat was pretty good in this car. Uh, old Aussie 50 um, from a uh, from YouTube. There, he um, he what you called it? He. Uh, was on about uh, his car temperature stay. No, it wasn't Aussie 50. So it was uh, V8 Jagnut. He put a new uh, thermostat in his uh, in his Mercedes, his old Mercedes, and uh, yeah, it did pretty good. That did. It wasn't bad at all. Uh, with this car, the temperature, the bulbs have almost blown in this. I mean, temperature that is about the normal temperature for this car when it's when it's running when you're in traffic jams it'll hit up to about the um, it'll, it'll hit up to about the uh, 100, 100 mark roughly but yeah it's uh, it's pretty good anyway getting close to home so our best uh, Turn the old uh, camera off. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out. Yeah, all back home, nice and good. See if we can get these bulbs to work, shall we? Come on. They're all there somewhere, and they don't blow because they're LED. There you go. They won't blow because they're LEDs. It's just that the holders doesn't work on them very well. Same as that one, that one goes off sometimes, the heater control, that's lovely and warm that is. I don't know if you're watching this Aussie 50, oh dear. It's like, look at the, look at the luxurious spec of the car here. There's you with all your air conditioning and your massive V, no not a V is it, it's a straight six, four litre engine. And here's, here's us lot in England. Yeah, we class our two, our two litre cars as a big car, a big engine. You know, and uh, yeah, mine's a luxury just to have electric windows, which are very slow in this. But hee <laughs> I had a spare bulb line around an LED which uh, which flashes. And it's good because when you when you're driving, you can't see it, so it doesn't annoy you. But when you want to check, open and close your window, it's it's there. Yeah, CB works. Anybody on? No doubt there'll be someone on. Being an idiot. It's a very very bad CB, but it works. Yeah, there's nobody there I can hear properly. Either miles away or somewhere else. But I've got that. There you go. There is someone there. But uh, hey, 
I've got that hooked up to the uh, the switch that my warning beacon was on, which is on the floor down there. That works all pretty good. I can put my bottom lights on now. There you go. Now you can see it. Yeah, and the poor camera doesn't know how to focus those in. That's quite dim it there. There you go. Oh, that looks good. Red, green, red. All well and good. My clock's all nice. Turn my lights off and it goes brighter. And my headlights are good now. Look, that's on dipped. That's on main. That's on full beam, sorry. That's flashing. So they all work really good. Yeah. She's running lovely. Couldn't be more happy with her. That's me doors unlocking themselves. Let me radio. Tell me that my faceplate's still on. Yeah. She does a good job. She gets me around. She drags my fat ass everywhere. <laughs> what more can you ask for, really? Lovely. Right. Cup of tea time.